Hello, good morning, madam. Let us know your name and let us get how you are feeling under this administration, particularly the issue of uh, your experience as it has to do with um, general, generally how you are feeling in this uh, government. Okay, good morning, sir. My own uh, feeling about this government is that oh, this is too expensive. This is too expensive. Transportation is high. I'm living at uh, Aguda here. From Aguda to Agege is 300 naira. Who is the time of good luck? 50 naira, 100 naira. You can enter transport to where you are going to. Now, this is very high, very expensive. Let, the, let our government bring things down for us. Okay, now, what other area do you like to comment? Because Nigerians are complaining. The other day, people protested because of hardship. Let me know, and they're saying October 1, they will go and protest again. Let me know whether you are getting it easier since after that protest, whether that protest made government to do good things for Nigerians. Government did not do anything. Since that protest, everything is still getting higher. Everything is getting higher. We are hearing bad news every day. Kidnappers are there. MO killings are there. We are hearing bad, bad news. Let us stop all this nonsense that they are doing. It does not make sense. It doesn't make sense. Let them bring things down for, for people. Okay, is, that, is there another thing you want to tell us? Is there another thing you want to tell us? Price of things is very coarse. So let them bring things down. Let them bring things down. You can buy rice. The record of rice now is 1,500 naira. Which is before is 500 naira, 700. Now it's 1,500 naira. Let them bring things down. This is too expensive for people to buy. Thank you very much for your time. I must say very thank you for madam. Thank you very much. Olua, one of Oba. We are looking at the performance of the government as government is set to celebrate. Nigerians are set to celebrate independence. And we'll be celebrating our independence October 1. People are asking, do we have anything to celebrate? Is the democracy worth celebrating? I want to ask you, as a man who has experienced democracy under different administrations of Olusha Guabasanjo, Jonathan, and um, Buhari, and Naturubu, do we have anything to celebrate? God bless you for that question. First and foremost, let me thank my, my viewers, Nigeria and diaspora. We are here again to analyze, to speak about Nigeria. When you say democracy, Nigeria is not a democratic state. It's a demonstration of craziness state. That is well for you. Reality. See, when you say democracy, there is a dividend of democracy. It's not happening here. Where they practice democracy, you can see the citizens, they are all where and devil. But here, suffering and smiling, right from day one to the end. To tomorrow, it's only God that you take me and you to the language of the, their home because they are bad. You see, democracy, yesterday when military was there, they we were even better than when civilian came. We were seeing air, fresh air. But the, the, the political class, politicians will tell you that no, under no, this, the they will tell you that under this administration, under democracy, that people now have freedom of speech. See, see, when you say freedom of speech, what is the meaning of freedom of speech? Like as you are speaking. Okay, I, I, when military was there, I will not speak. Eh? I can tell you categorically when a butcher was there, you see, the first day, the, the, the criminals, the one that's come not called yourself politicians, they are the one far from the, the one that don't want me or you to live. You can imagine what is happening now as of assembly. You know how many billions, trillion, when military was there, how many? All those boys, they know they like that. See road, they go drown, that one way they go drown. But now see this road, see over here, see my area here. Hundred years, they never drown. The, the packing money, packing money, millions. What is your packing money? Packing, stealing, authority stealing, authority stealing, authority stealing, authority. The name of local, local government, chairman, uh, commissioner of road, all of them are practical evil democracy. They are evil, evil democracy. democracy. And you now expect us to be celebrating when your beloved food and the church king, we never even see full chops since yesterday till now. I would say, we are not the same. So are you questioning democracy in Nigeria that is not the government or the people by the power for the people? It's, it's zero less. You know, get one, you no know, score two. So if you democracy, when you say democracy, democracy, I already told you, it's not practicing here. We are just using that name, democracy. Under the umbrella is demonstration of craziness. Okay, witchcraft now. demonstration, witchcraft democracy, witchcraft. 
Can you see somebody like Akpabi or see that president telling you and I go and protest and we will be enjoying here? You are telling me that we are celebrating democracy. Democracy. It's not democracy. It's crazy demo. Demonstration of craziness. Somebody buying cars, 200 cars, what 200 million per one. They don't care about you and I. You are saying democracy, they work, but I never say so wrong. They never say house of assembly. Me and you there for suffering and smiling, walk on the street, look for where we eat, no food to eat. No money, no work, what you don't see. Okay, look, if, I'm, if I, I may ask you to assess the administration of Senator Abe Balatunubu on the basis of security and welfare of Nigerians, what will be your assessment? Complex, security is zero, welfare of Nigeria is zero. Everything, is, see, you say the truth is bitter, but the truth will set you free. Ask anybody in Nigeria is not well. And that truth must be said. That truth must be said. Okay, how long? You say now Nigeria to Lagos to Calabar Coast, now that won't be a reality. You see, let us be let us be sincere. Let us be sincere with ourselves. Nigeria is not governed accordingly. So it's just just what my sister has just said. A transport from here is supposed to be 100 and 300, 400. Okay, now for now that go they came at the end, they said Kaba. At the end, suffering increase. Increasement of suffering every day in Nigeria. You are calling democracy celebration. What is the meaning of it? Thank you very much, Oluawan. As always, we hope to have you next time. Oh, and uh, we must say very big thank you for your time. I think this is a good place to let you go. I'm Mr. Matu and this is Media. Thank you very much for your time.